Well, a local business gave away hundreds of free meals and emergency supply kits to a community recovering from destruction caused by a tornado. 41 NBC's Andrew Willis reports. Behind me, volunteers are preparing to distribute over 500 meals, including bags filled with snacks and bottled water, to community members of Milledgeville who were affected by the tornado that touched down Monday. Dozens of cars lined up in front of the East Annex building in Milledgeville to receive free meals distributed by the Forrest B. Johnson and Associates law firm. Attorney and president of the firm, Forrest B. Johnson, jumped into action when he heard Milledgeville was hit by a tornado. When I saw um, uh, the devastation left by the tornado, I um, probably within 24 hours of that contacted uh, my office and said, what can we do? The law firm spent an estimated $15,000 to provide food, drinks, and care packages for the community. Meals were prepared by SNS Cafeteria, and care packages provided by the Red Cross included deodorant, shampoo, and toothbrushes. Mayor of Milledgeville, Mary Parham Copeland, was away from the city when the tornado hit. Though devastated by the destruction, she expressed her gratitude for Johnson's efforts. With him stepping up, helping us out, making sure we're taking care of the underserved, those that's been through the destruction of this tornado, uh, it has just floored me. One Milledgeville resident who picked up a meal and a care package said she was just five blocks away from the path of the tornado. Our lights went out for 11 hours, and I had food to spoil in the freezer and refrigerator, but I thank God, you know, no one was hurt in Milledgeville. No fatalities, and I thank these great people for donating, Forrest B. Johnson, for donating this to us. We need it. We need it. For Johnson, Milledgeville is an extension of where he calls home, so he knew he had to help the community in any way possible. I think that if you've been blessed to have, I think the greatest next blessing that you could have is to give and to reach out to those who are not quite as fortunate as you are especially in a time of need. In Milledgeville, Andrew Willis, 41 NBC News. Good stuff there. Johnson says giving back could not have happened without the support of his team and help from volunteers.